Meanwhile, the best performance of the season so far follows at the city ground. Just teased down the line for Stan Lazaridis. Cross towards Dowie. And Bowen has scored for West Ham. Oh, what was he doing there? Mark Bowen's first goal for West Ham United. They take the lead with just over a minute of the first half remaining. Cross hung up towards Dowie. Neither he nor Pierce could make contact, but Bowen got in ahead of Allen and West Ham lead. That's towards Roy. Tangle with Reaper, who's been penalised. And the referee, Gary Willard, wants to have a word with Mark Reaper here. And he's going to card him, and I wonder whether he feels that Reaper was the last defender. He does, he's off. I don't think there's any doubt that he had an arm round the waist of Brian Roy as they chased that long ball from Ian Wone, but would anybody else have caught up? Maybe not. Reaper goes, and West Ham are down to ten men. This is Yurkan with the shot, blocked by Bishop. Holland's got it back from Moncur away by Bilic and a chance maybe here of a West Ham counter. Tony Cotty has Michael Hughes and now Ian Bishop in support. Still Cotty, he's found a way through, good stop by Crossley, Cotty again, Hughes, yes! Down to ten men but up to 2-0. Michael Hughes within a minute of Bar Reaper's dismissal. Mark to Tony Cotty, he had support, but not enough to dissuade him from trying his luck himself. He almost ran through the three defenders here, little catching him up. Phillips trying to stop him, Pierce trying to cover, got it his shot, that was blocked. He had another bite in it there, and Michael Hughes it was who walloped it in to double West Ham United's lead. A precious win for the Hammers' ten men.